Good afternoon. Today's video is 68 Charles Street, Minyip, on the market with Northwest Real Estate for 199,000. There's a period style home in a prominent corner location, about one block from the main street of town. It's got uh, three bedrooms, one bathroom, double carport, and a uh, really nice uh, entertaining area on the back. We'll uh, go and check it out inside. So I've just come in through the front door and I thought I'd show you the lead light in the front door on the sideboards there. Um, yeah, it's quite good and all intact Can't see any cracks or anything. So it's it's pretty good. There is a modern electrical switchboard up there So that's been taken care of So we'll turn first turn to the right as we come through the front door uh, The house is being packed up at the moment the gentleman that owns the house has moved into aged care and uh, His family's packing up the house so it does look like it's um, being packed up at the moment, as you can see. But good size room, double room, carpet on the floor, no built-in robes in this room, but a good room. Across the passage, bedroom number two. We do have a ceiling fan up there behind the light. Uh, we have a wardrobe there that'll probably stay. But yeah, another quite good sized room. Vaporative air conditioning duct up on the roof or ceiling. Every AFL club is represented in this house. So there's the Fremantle Dockers. You'll see other stuff. There's a Carlton jumper on that bed there. Bedroom number three. We've got a, a uh, ceiling fan. It's another double room with built-in robes there. The light shade uh, makes the light in here a bit, uh, a bit speckly. Straight across the passage, we've got a linen press and the bathroom, which is a fairly tight bathroom. That's the shower recess and the vanities around the corner. And there is a cupboard behind the door. There's the controls to the evap cooler. We've got a timber kitchen, quite a nice timber kitchen actually. Gas cooktop, electric stove. It's got the exhaust fan or the range hood above the stove or the hop lights. A spot for the fridge there. The utility cupboard and the microwave shelf there. Nice uh, pair of glass doors there and a bit of a pantry in the corner there. Do have a small split system. I think it's just a heater up there. Stand to be corrected on that. I probably will be by the family. Into the lounge room. Good size lounge. Got a door that goes out onto the front veranda or the side veranda. Got a ceiling fan, vac cooler outlet. At some stage, there was a wood heater here, but look at it. We've even got half down here, but it's been replaced for the more user-friendly gas heater. As I said, the house is being packed up by the family at the moment, so it does have that um, look about it. We're out the back now, so we've got the laundry. There would have been an old wood stove where the oven and the hot plates were before in the kitchen, but that's the back of the chimney that was still remains. We've got this little mud room here in wood panel. Got the toilet and the office. Got bombers stuff there, Eureka flag. But yeah, good size office. So you got three really big double bedrooms plus the office. You've got the glass sliding door here that goes out onto a, a nice deck. This is a good size, quite large actually. And Got uh, bistro blinds that come down. Good 
spot to send, spend the summers. And then we've got the backyard. Got the uh, fake astro turf here. Stone garden. There's gates that come in off the side street over there. A lot of brick paving. A lot of shelters. Rainwater tanks. There's rainwater tanks here everywhere. There's two there. There's two over there. I reckon there might be one around this side. And there's another rainwater tank. So it's like a little water farm, isn't it? Farming the water that comes off the roof of the house. Got some garden sheds. There's a uh, pump there that pumps the rainwater inside. A uh, bit of a fernery around this side. We're on the north side of the house now. And we've got the double carport steel framed. It's all pretty good. Concrete on the ground. So this is 68 Church Street, Minyap, on the market with Northwest Real Estate for $199,000. Three bedrooms and an office, double carport, good prominent corner block close to the main street of town. And if you'd like any more information on this property, you can contact myself, John Hadley, on 0428 560 630. Thank you for watching my video.